There are a number of fossils from the late Devonian which are classified as primitive tetrapods. They are tetrapods and classified as amphibians. They possess a neck, although a neck was also present in some fish such as Tiktaalik. They possess a number of skull modifications such as the reduction and loss of internal gills. And they possess multi-jointed fingers and toes. So their arms and legs possess multi-jointed digits. And these are recognized as more advanced than Sarcopterygian fish as primitive tetrapods. The earliest tetrapods of the late Devonian were transitional as fossils which possessed a number of primitive ancestral features from the Sarcopterygian fish. They uh, possessed a number of bones found in fish but which are absent in later amphibians. They retained bones and supports for internal gills. They possessed a lateral line system, a sensory system uh, which allow fish to find prey moving in water. So the skulls of the early amphibians had traits uh, which they had inherited uh, from the ancestral Sarcopterygian fish. The vertebral column of the first tetrapods is not the vertebral column which modern tetrapods possessed. The notochord uh, was uninterrupted and stretched along the body as the main longitudinal support of the body. There were vertebrae, but the vertebrae existed in a number of separate pieces, uh, typically which did not fuse across the midline. There were bony rods uh, in the tail, dermal rods, which uh, gave these early amphibians a fish-like tail, uh, probably better adapted for locomotion in the water than it was for locomotion on land. A number of other features in these early amphibians were primitive as well. There were primitive features of the girdles and limb bones. Uh, the neck was less mobile in some because of the penetration of the notochord into the back of the skull. Uh, the arms and legs uh, were less mobile because the joints typical of later tetrapods had not yet uh, evolved or at least uh, evolved well. There were more than five digits. Acanthostega had eight uh, digits in its limbs, Ichthyostega had seven, and Tulerpaton had six. So it seems that five uh, digits on the hands and feet was a later feature. There were fish-like scales on the underside in many of the early tetrapods and even some of the early reptiles. So uh, this fish characteristic was retained for quite some time. So these early amphibians were truly transitional fossils uh, with both tetrapod uh, features which were derived and ancestral sarcopterygian features as well.